Hi there, this is Dr. Pan recording from Tucson, Arizona. Hope life is treating you well. Thank you for watching this clip on La Pitons Rule. Here we have a pretty uh, messy expression to evaluate the limit to. Before I started that, let's lighten the mood. A friend of mine sent a funny picture here. I don't know how appropriate it is, but here it is. All right, back to back, La Pitons Rule. So let's check if it's 0 over 0 first. 1 minus when I, y equal to 0, then it's e to the 0, which is 1. So on top we have a 0, on the bottom we have a 0. So yes, we do have a 0 over 0 case. And then let's take the limit. So the top is uh, 0 minus e to the derivative is itself. Now, since there are two terms, you do have to use chain rule, and we are interested in derivative against with respect to variable y, so we have minus s has to be put out. And on the bottom is a positive s. Let's see what we have here. Minus minus cancels out. S and s cancels out. Oh, that's pretty nice. And so it's e to the minus s and limit y to the 0. And this one, of course, equal to positive 1. So it's not too bad. All right? That's how we handle La Pitons rule for this particular problem. Once again, from Tucson, Arizona, this is Dr. Pan making learning math fun, at least trying to. If the video has been helpful, I would appreciate a comment or a thumb up. Until next time, have a confident day.